What the fuck is that thing? Alright, so I gotta like cut this thing open now. Apparently this beetle pig has eaten the cat. Now I gotta go- oh, What the fuck are you going? What's this? Curiosity be damned. Damn you, curiosity. Anyway. Why won't you let me take the key? What are you? What is the right question, but why would be? Okay, I want the key. Just give me the... I don't have time to chat, sir. I want the key, that's all. But the key isn't ours, and it's not yours for sure. Just give it to me. Couldn't care less about... What? We couldn't care less. The affection towards you is simply none. I'm Fran. Very honest, I like that. I'm a person, Fran. Pleased to meet you. Tell us more. I had a cat. I have a cat. It's missing. Have to find him. A filthy thief took our comb. Now we're stuck forever. If you find the thief and the comb, you'll get the key. Deal? What does he look like? It's a rat. A filthy narcissist rat. <laughs> he took the comb to make himself look beautiful. We couldn't do much, so we ran away with it. Please find it and free us. I'll find him. A feather? Is that a feather to tickle the pig? Right here. That makes sense. No. Tickle, tickle, tickle. Wake up! Yeah, the beetle pig keeps running away. So what should I do? You have to give him the special berries, the blueberries. Where do I find the berries? <laughs> I shouldn't say this to you, but I have the right connections. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck? They live inside my house. They have blueberries. My house is in that direction. Be careful. Your house is in this direction? This direction? Oh, there's the fucking- Hey! Look, Fran, I'm in danger. Find me alive. Find me dead. Oh, my God, this is fucked. Got the pills. Is he there? No. Okay, this is his house. What we got? We got glue. We got a brush. Queen of meat. Okay. Not gonna ask questions on that one. He's eating a lot of meat. What the fuck? There's a whole ass pine cone family in here. <laughs> Knock this baby over. There we go. Yeah, boy. Nah. There we go. We don't need that shit no more. All right, we got the blueberries. What's oh, the ghost again? <laughs> Just waves at her. Now die. Die. Where's the cat, buddy? Maybe it's my cat. If he is, then he's the one in trouble now. Where'd you last see him? And she's so crazy. <laughs> I can show you. Follow me, please. It's not far from here. Did you steal a hair comb? Oh, yeah, I forgot about it. Give it to me. All right then, but can you please comb my hair first? Yeah, sure, why not? There you go. All right, now we can go back to the stupid tree and cut.
cut this fucking hair. There we go. Let's go. There we go. And we use this key, right? Let's go. There we go. What a curious little door. I wonder will it, where it will lead me. Probably nowhere good. Mr. Midnight, are you here? Oh, ghost lady. Oh, something's going on. Get out of there, Fran. Fran Bow. Chapter 2, Part 2. Double person. Oh, okay. Guess we gotta squeeze in some of this, maybe? Nice hat. <laughs> you have a cat hat. Um. Hello? Hello. <laughs> she waves at her. Who are you? Are you the ghost? That's a bad smell. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, thanks. What's up here? Can't see very well. Alright, let's take a look around. Oh my. Oh, I don't want to hear that. Yay! We found the cat. And he missed me so much. I love you too. Aw, it's like her only friend. After this, people took you away to the woods I tried to follow them, but after a while I got lost, my senses were too weak to track you. I tried to catch some food to recover, but something happened. Somebody took me and put me in this cage. I'll open the cage. It's gonna be fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Uh, yeah, sure. Ask me something. Did you feel my presence in your dreams? Yes, I did. Okay. Just don't worry about the medicine. Just, just don't worry about it. All right. It's magic. Yeah, it's magic. Okay. Fran's losing her mind. All right. How do we get her out? How do we get her out? Can we take the pills here? Drops you all the way back. Okay. Never mind. Oh, oh my good god. What the fuck? Fran Bow is your name, right? Your mom and dad died tragically. It was very brutal, right? Now you really want to know who killed them, right? How do you know? We simply have to know, we are part of this world. Don't be sad, bad things happen to us all the time. You haven't asked about your cat yet. It's very odd for a girl who loves her cat more than anything else in the world. Yet you look so calm after finding him in a cage, hungry and scared. Shouldn't it be us trembling in fear of you? I love him though. That's why I'm here. You want him back? Unlock the cage. He's hungry and thirsty. Before we set him free, tell us how you came here. It's a long story. I escaped from a place, a very ugly place. They opened the heads of children to find out what's wrong with them. Phil told me a secret and I was clever enough to find a way out. And then I came into the woods and met a giant ant and killed a bug and it was terrible. Then I met a rat. I wanted to get his hair done. 
I thought I made a door. And that door took me here. But when I entered the door, something happened. I don't remember anything else, but I saw a pine cone family. That was before I came here. They live in Mr. Antonio's house. They like berries. <laughs> I saw flying insects get stuck in trees because they have long hair. You shouldn't wander around someone else's house without permission. Are you stupid with no family at all? Yeah, that's true. I'm sorry. If you don't do exactly as you say, you and your cat will die. We will force you to kill him with your own hands. You are evil. Good. Listen to us carefully. We need to perform a magic spell. Magic is magical. Who doesn't like magic anyway? The magic is very powerful and dangerous. Here's the recipe. Be careful and precise. Otherwise, terrible things will happen. I will need the heart of a frog, head of a young virgin, hair and blood from a black cat, pentagram made of ashes, and the burnt body of a fox. Why you like this now? One night, a long time ago, something happened before us. We thought it was an angel, but it wasn't. He decided that we should spend eternity together. He cursed us to be like this, never understood why. We have a spell to bring him back, and we'll do it later when we're no longer attached to each other and show him that he's powerless and he will regret it. Sounds like a plan, actually. Let's do it. Do you see this key? Can you imagine what can be opened? Okay, no need for taunting. Like I said I'd help you, fuck. Okay, I'm gonna leave it there for now. Um, we're just kind of getting into something really weird, I feel like. What the hell is going on? This game is a mind fuck. I'm out of here, alright? Like and subscribe. Peace out. This shit's just creeping me out. Oh,